And welcome back to another video. Today I've prepared 10 Minecraft wheelbarrow designs for you and in this video I'm just going to go through all 10 designs and show you some of the tips and tricks I use to make them. So for the first design here we have a very just standard Minecraft wheelbarrow design but I really really like it because it is very simple but it's still very good. What we've done here is we've used an item hopper followed by a oak fence gate that is opened facing the hopper and then item frames with just gray concrete blocks in them rotated to look like wheels. Now I think it's worth mentioning that for all these designs I use the same color of fence gate on all of them. You can mix this up if you want but I've just kept it simple and used this just standard oak wood texture and it is just really up to you but it really doesn't matter because you can just replace it on all these designs but this is the best block to use for handlebars and moving on to the next design we have the most classic and simple minecraft wheelbarrow what it is is it's just a cauldron filled with water with the handlebars on the back and the reason i like this so much is because you can kind of have the legs of the cauldron imitate wheels if you're open-minded enough but the main key feature to this is the ability to hold water in the wheelbarrow which actually gives it a function so this is actually a little bit more than aesthetic it does have a functionality Moving on to this next design, what we've done here is we just have a oak wood slab using oak trap doors for wheels and then just the standard handlebars on the back. I really like this design because not only does it look really good, but it also has just this flat face on the top, so you can place item frames and whatever to decorate the top, it's really up to you. Next design here, what we have is a oak stair that's just flipped upside down using the item frames with the concrete blocks again but instead of being rotated on their side they are square for the wheels and the oak fence gate opened up for the handlebars next design here we have an empty cauldron with the standard handlebars but what i've actually gone ahead and done here is i've added a sign with an equal sign pasted all the way down the side and what this does is it actually makes it look like the sign is connected to the cauldron in a very sturdy way. I really like this design. I definitely love using signs and the symbols you can put on them in creative ways to help detail a build and I think this is an excellent example of that being utilized in a good way. Next design here, this is probably the best design you're gonna see here because not only does it look fantastic but it also has a chest in it. So what we've done here is we have two oak trap doors for the wheels with the standard handlebars but what we've done is we've dropped in a minecart with a chest to actually make up the body of the wheelbarrow and let me just take a moment to explain why this design is so good what it does here is you'll see that the handlebars are actually connected to the build flush with this pixel here on every other build you'll notice a slight gap that is very hard to see but for a keen eye and more experienced builders you will realize that's there but with the minecart it's completely flush and just looks great and because the oak trap door has this checkered pattern even though it is very square because you know it is a square you can kind of get that illusion that it is just having those spokes in a wheel that pop out just looking really good and then that minecart shape really mimics a wheelbarrow well and the chest in the middle which actually makes it functional awesome design my favorite definitely recommend it moving on to the next one here we have just the general concept of having water as a function as the first cauldron here but what I like about this wheelbarrow is the shape because it is just kind of off center a little bit because this is actually a waterlogged trap door that you can see it doesn't pop up on the side of the block here because this bl block is occupied by the fence gate that is open so it is just a little bit thinner of water and we have that nice slight subtle curve that comes into play due to the fact that we have these notches taken out of the corner so overall interesting design but the main thing it has going for it is the shape now this design here i'm also a huge fan of because it has wheels what we've done here is we've put armor stands with two wither skeleton heads facing each other to give that just black just texture on the ground there that really imitates wheels well this design here is just a slab with uh signs 
put all the way around it, but there's the key feature here is the wheels because it is so hard to find little details like this, but using this armor stand trick, we are able to do this. To get these heads to face right here, what we've done is we've placed two armor stands on either side of the build, pushed them in using pistons, and then pushed the blocks down on top. If you want to know how to do this, check out my armor stand tutorial. If it's not up on my channel, by the time this video goes live, it will be out very soon. And on the last two designs here, what we've done is we've just have another minecart design with an item hopper in it. So it does have storage, albeit not as much, but it is a little bit more flush with the minecart. It has a nice little dip in it that does mimic the general shape of a wheelbarrow in real life. But what we've gone ahead and done with this build is we've actually pushed it an extra couple pixels back into the build for to be exact so the handlebars aren't quite as long and they look a lot more sturdy because they are supporting the build just with much more thickness now moving on to the rest of the design to just kind of cover up the fact that this minecart is offset we've gone ahead and placed it signs all the way around to just give it a little bit of extra shape and detail Moving on to the next design here, we've used this armor stand trick once again to make wheels in the minecart just using the fence gate as the handlebars and then we just have a minecart with two signs on either side of it. And that's all the designs I had prepared for you today. I hope that you guys now feel a little spark of creativity to use these wheelbarrows in your gardens. It's a really awesome detail to use and it definitely helps bring builds to life. So without further ado, that's all I wanted to cover in this video. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you in the next video.